what is going on guys welcome back to the channel i know it's been about three to four days since i've uploaded a video or even done any streaming or anything like that and you know i just want to say i'm sorry guys uh unfortunately for me i did injure my foot accidentally and i was uh, pretty much recovering from that i also from the pain when i injured it i uh, suffered uh, a syncope episode for everyone who doesn't know i do suffer from syncope when it comes to pain related stuff so when i'm in really really bad pain uh my body my blood pressure drops and i most of the time would faint unless i'm sitting down before it happens uh so lucky for me i knew i was about to faint i had five seconds to get down real quick and lucky for me i got down in time and i didn't really anything happen seriously so recovered within like 10 seconds after that uh so yeah i just wanted to take some time relax myself not bother with the whole stream and youtube right now and just take recover and take a little break from it uh i was burned out with a lot of things happening so uh with the work also as well it's just didn't help me with, with the foot injury boom so uh, I am fine now, if anyone's worried, I'm okay, don't worry, uh, it's a thing I have to live with for the rest of my life when it comes to syncopy mm -hmm. stuff, but eventually, uh, I'll be fine. Uh, I just do want to say I'm sorry for everyone who missed me, and I do apologize. I really didn't, didn't really have spent any money on LMS, which is another reason why I didn't want to stream it, because when you stream LMS, you really gotta spend a shit ton of money. And, uh, it wasn't something I really wanted to do, I really wanted to put myself at like a 3,000 limit. Right now, I'm currently spent about 4,000 credits so far on this LMS. Currently ranked 77 in the world. So this LMS has been honestly really, really dead for what it seems to be. Uh, 1 million points at 77 rank right now at this last day is quite honestly sad as hell. LMS has never been this low in my opinion. But uh, again, I don't want to spend a crap load of money because it's here is officially dead after, this, after next week's event, which is going to be uh, the women's and then i'm also going to give you guys my advice for everything coming out what you should spend on what because again uh the stuff in the store and the promos again this month is honestly just another f <laughs> another fail in my opinion uh, i'll break it down for you guys how my opinion is about the whole alpha delta omega all that crap so let's actually get into that right now uh, i can't do any lms right now because i still need to get one more block off the draft board it's kind of taking me a while <laughs> but eventually i'll get it so whatever but let's go ahead and get into the store about the new promo this month. So as you all knew, LMS, they didn't put any boosters in the store at all. Now, I would have saved a shitload of more money if they included it into the store. If free packs were in there day one, uh, we had to wait an extra day and a half almost to get it in free packs. So unfortunately, we kind of got screwed there. When it came to that, so I could have probably spent maybe three, two, two to three thousand credits f to finish the whole LMS because I am on Arena 101 right now or 102. So I could have spent way less, but unfortunately, Supercard screwed us with the LMS booster. I don't know why they didn't include it in this, it makes no sense for a thing that's supposed to be hobby related. It's not, it's just making it more grind related because the only way you could get it is from fear packs and grinding. It made zero sense for LMS to me, but you know. Shout out to Cat Daddy for, I guess, making everyone's lives torturous at this time uh, when we don't need it. But as you all know, there are these packs in the store now that is pretty much... So I know a lot of people love the money in the bank stuff. Um, it's not for me. As much as I love images and stuff, I don't really care for these images that much. Sure, I, I'll miss out on them. They'll probably come back one day again, but I'm not too bothered about getting them. I got a lot of them already, so... To get a duplicate, it's not something I would want. But, you know, it is nice to get 1,500 contracts. And, of course, uh, Delta is not bad either. As you all know, we do have these collectibles. Now, every day you can get 200 Alpha, I believe, and 75 Delta from the draft board. And it is a 35-day event from when they did release this. Unfortunately, the Delta is honestly going to be really hard because... You, honestly, I think maybe if you did all the Delta, you could get maybe one Christian, and that's about it. You can't get the Pro Christian unless you spend money on the packs in the store to get it. And they'll also be in Giants Unleashed and stuff like that. But again, that's another spend to get the top rank rewards, and you're probably going to need to spend to get the Delta 
and Alpha and the other last one, Omega, pretty much. And then, of course, they have this Natalia in the store that people really, really, really want. But the thing is, is you need 2,000 Omega. And with this, you could turn this into that. But honestly, in my opinion, it's just not going to be worth it. Now, look how long it's going to take me to get just 100. I need 2,000. I need to get 100. Of just grinding free play, you're looking at roughly five, six days. You're not going to be able to get it for free. Natalia is impossible to get for free. I believe you may be able to get Christian, just one Christian for free. But again, what does a single benefit me? Uh, it could benefit some of you guys, but it won't benefit me. So honestly, this promo is meh at best. It's just for, this is promo for another promo to suck money out of you guys, to be honest with you. It's just not good. It's just not good. I, I don't enjoy this promo at all. But, but anyways, so guys, if you want my personal opinion on this, as much as beautiful as this card is, avoid Natalia. Next week, we're going to be getting a Giants Unleashed Women's. So if you're in WrestleMania tier, you can get the card. This will only be beneficial if you can't get the card. But again, it's just too much money for what it's worth. But if you get the Giants Unleashed, you could easily spend 5,000, 10,000 credits and get a way better OP card than this Natalia F3. That is my personal opinion. It is a waste to bother with this a card. It's only beneficial if you want an extra tag in there, but again, it's not really worth it in my opinion. So guys, honestly, avoid Natalia. Uh, it's just not worth it. If you want to get Christian as a right arrow, it's decent. You can tag it with Undertaker and Edge. You can get the Edge and Christian tag team. I can understand that. But it's also not worth it if you have like NWOs, like F1s, F2, F3s. It's just not worth it, in my opinion. I'm going to make my Kevin Nash an F3 after I get Drew McIntyre. So for me, every card now is pretty much useless unless it's an event card, which is cheaper than all these other card promotions we get. Now, that's going to get me now to Gronkowski. Let's go ahead and talk about Gronk. Okay, guys, it is now 3 o'clock. No booster, as I predicted in the store. It just seems to be an LMS of no boosters. However, we do get another opportunity at the Gronk. Now, I'm going to press my luck to see how far I can go with this. Obviously, the first card is always free. Uh, but we'll see how far I can go. See if my strategy can work out. So, usually what I do is I usually go... 2 to the left left. And then the last one all the way to the right is my strategy as you can see that benefited me quite well so we'll get all these other cars and stuff like that yada 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 nice 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 same strategy here I usually go to left and then another one all the way to the right perfect 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 and we died <laughs> but again you're gonna die here and there i want to one day get this perfect run for free and record it however the odds of you getting it free is maybe like a five percent to zero percent chance but i will try my best one day uh but the thing is with this bounty breaker stuff is it comes so late in the tier that it just doesn't feel like i need it that's the problem with this bounty breaker it took a month to come in if they implemented this with the NWO one, I can understand me going for it. But again, there's just no point for now at this point going for a Gronk. Like, first off, it's Gronkowski for all the cards. I don't care about Gronkowski. I really don't. And uh, it's just not beneficial for me for a card. It really isn't. I love you, Gronk, but I just don't need you, buddy. I really don't. Because Kevin Nash will be my F3. And as you all know, Money in the Bank has 100 contracts per win now. So go ahead and play your Money in the Bank, guys, all entire month. Get some contracts. And, uh, yeah, have fun with it. Uh, if you do your Money in the Bank, you could easily get 70,000 contracts this month alone. If you do a lot of your free ballots and stuff like that. And if you do ads, you can get way more with ads. So I recommend you guys do your Money in the Bank this month. And you guys already know the decks to type of use to you. I know you guys are very smart. You guys already know what decks to use for Money in the Bank. If you don't, then obviously you don't know what to tell you, man. Uh, look, on, look on YouTube. I'm sure you'll be able to find some Money in the Bank videos out there. Just look for one. You don't have to search a thousand.
But anyways, guys, that would do it for today's episode. I hope you all enjoyed it. If you guys did, smash the like button, subscribe to the channel. We're on the road to 20,000. We're almost there. Uh, and, yeah, that's it. So thanks again, guys, once again. I know I haven't done my list of legends. Uh, I will do it in the next episode. I just want to let you guys know I'm, I'm okay and don't, don't freak out. Uh, I love you guys so much. Thank you for everything. I will see you on the next episode. Take care. Have a good one. Have a fun LMS, even though it's been a terrible LMS, to be honest. But for me, I've actually enjoyed it because it was actually cheap as shit to finish. So no hate for me. <laughs> Peace out, guys.